Subscribe and like click please. Hi. This video is RPO play which can be used in two back formations. It is a play that is made by combining isolation play and full back flat pass routes. This play has a pattern similar to the read option, and in this play, the movement of the defense end is read and the play is decided. I will show you how to deploy this play. It's simple. I said that this play will read the movement of the defense end and determine the play. If the defense end moves outwards to make it hard to get involved in the isolation play, you can choose the isolation play to deploy the attack. If the defense end moves inward and becomes a situation where he can tackle the tail back, the quarterback is to select the full back's flat pass moving outwards. I will tell you the important points of this play. 1. Slot receiver alignment. If it is too narrow, the outsider linebacker can be involved in the isolation play, and if it is too wide, the flat pass route becomes difficult. 2. It is important that the quarterback is able to correctly pass through the quick motion. When the quarterback is reading the movement of the defense end, it must be fast to pass to the full back without handoff to the tailback. If this action is slow, the full back is getting farther away, so the success rate of the pass is reduced, and the faster pass must be able to run while watching the downfield more freely. When the defense end moves outward. when the defense end moves inward. It's a pattern similar to the read option. If your team's ability to run quarterbacks is a little off, you might want to use RPO of this pattern instead of the read option. Formation does not have to be the same as this formation. For each team, you need to make a more effective offense by determining how the player composition is most effective, how the defending team is weak to the pattern, and so on. What do you think about the videos I made? Communicate with comments and grow together. Click subscribe and like.